वेलकम टू लर्न योर सेल्फ अवर नेक्स्ट सेट ऑफ एग्जाम्पल्स आर फ्रॉम पेज नंबर एट एंड दिज आर ट्राई दिस सम्स फ्रॉम चैप्टर नंबर वन इंटीजर अंडर सी बी एस ई स्टैंडर्ड सेवन सिलेबस So this is write a pair of integers whose sum gives. That means we have to do addition on two of the integers. So these two integers should give us a negative integer as an answer. So how we will get a negative integer from the addition? So when a bigger number will carry negative sign, then we will get as an answer a negative integer so minus 7 plus 3 so whatever answer we will get is 4 and this will give us negative integer minus plus will become minus so here we have to do subtraction but this is addition so in this addition minus plus will become minus so we have to subtract this to integers and answer will carry bigger numbers sign now next zero when we will get zero out of two integers when they are exactly same with opposite sign for example four plus four and one of the four should be minus so then we will get zero so this is addition as we have to do addition and one of the integer is negative and the same integer will be positive then we will get zero now next an integer smaller than both the integer so this is our answer so whatever answer we will get here is it should be smaller than both of this integer so we have to choose integer like that and we have to add them and then whatever answer we will get that should be smaller than both of these two. How that can be possible? When we will take both the integers with negative sign. So what will happen? When we will take both the integers of negative sign, this will lead to addition. And when we will add them, we will get a number 5 with minus sign. Why? Because bigger number is carrying negative sign. So minus 5 is smaller than both the integer and yet this is addition. After addition we got this and we got a smaller integer. This can be possible only when two negative integers we are adding. Next, integer should be smaller than only one of the integer. That means whatever answer we will get here will be smaller than any one of the integer and that also means that this integer should be bigger than one of the integer so we will arrange the numbers like 5 with minus 3 one integer is positive and one integer is negative so this will give us a subtraction operation so here we will get 2 and this will carry bigger number sign. So we will get here 2. So this is smaller than this but yet this is bigger than this. So integer smaller than only one of the integer. That can be only possible when one of the integer is positive and one of the integer is negative. And then we will get the subtraction and from that whatever we will get. That number will obviously bigger than negative integer and smaller than positive integer. Now next, an integer should be greater than both the integers. So our answer should be bigger than both the integers. So we have to choose a pair such that our answer should be bigger than both and it is easy when it is addition. When you add any two positive number, you will get answer and that will be bigger than these two integers. Our next question is write pair of integers whose difference will give. Earlier it was sum, now it is difference. So we have to perform subtraction operation on two integers such that it will give us a negative integer. When a bigger number will carry negative sign that will always give us 
negative integer in addition and subtraction so let us choose minus 5 now next integer what we will choose it has to be smaller than minus 5 so subtraction because they have asked us for difference so this is subtraction and then we will write here 3 so here minus 5 minus 3 will give us minus 8 they have not asked any bigger or smaller number only negative integer so minus 5 minus 3 will give us minus 8 now 0 when we will get a 0 out of difference when two opposite integers will be there so 4 minus 4 will give us 0 if you will add minus here and then you will do subtraction then minus minus will become plus and we have to do addition on that and answer will carry the sign negative so this will be the answer for these two integers when you will make it this minus minus and you will guess that this number is positive because you have not added negative sign but when you are writing like this this negative sign will applicable to this number also so here we will write this 4 minus 4 and we will get here 0 now next an integer smaller than both the integer that means we have to choose two integer and we have to subtract them and the answer what we will get it has to be smaller than both the integers so when we are subtracting any two integer then whatever answer we will get that will be smaller than both the integers so it is easy in subtraction it is easy our next sum integer should be greater than only one of the integer so that means it should be bigger than one and it should be smaller than one so when we are taking 5 minus 3 a simple subtraction we will get 2 so 2 is bigger than minus 3 because here we are considering minus 3 so 2 is bigger than minus 3 at the same time 2 is smaller than 5 then next an integer greater than both the integer so whatever answer we will get it should be bigger than both the integers so when we are taking 5 minus minus 3 so what it will lead to it will lead to 5 plus 3 this minus minus will become plus so you will get 8 here and 8 is bigger than both the integers.